Hello lovers and friends and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I just wanted to share the farewell party held by ICOC Qatar family. And before that, welcome to the house of Sister Jenny and Brother Bobby. They are the awesome couple who lead the singles ministry in ICOC Qatar. Yes, there is a farewell party or what we call it also as an encouragement party for everyone not only for me so by the way before i go to their house i send a message to sister jenny what should i bring but she told me you don't need to bring anything wow they are really awesome when i reach there sister marites and sister jenny are preparing everything and also brother bobby of course, I was a display assistant during this time. <laughs> Joke lang. So, after preparing everything, some of the brothers and sisters arrived and got a chance to talk and having a fellowship to them. And actually, I really wanted to extend my gratitude and lift up God because I didn't expect all those things and surprises. Food, messages encouragement letter that they preferred for me and for us by the way for those who are asking me why i am not afraid to travel alone to different places the answer is because i always have a brothers and sisters that i can call or consider as a family introducing our icoc disciples family yes i am forever grateful that i am part of this family of disciples and you also guys can be part of us before i came here to qatar i didn't expect that there is an icoc church family but the good news is my icoc jensen family informed me that there is a sister church in qatar and they gave me the contact of the leaders here in ICOC Qatar and they connect me to them. And suddenly, because of my work schedule, I can fellowship with them sometimes or just like I have a free or day off. But we need to remember that whatever it takes, as a disciple, we need to persevere to grow our relationship with God, to be more faithful by reading the Word of God and doing our quiet time every day, to be inspired by others and to share our faith to those people who surround me or who surround us. And to my ICOC Qatar family, I just wanted to say thank you so much for all your love, support, and sharing your wisdom, especially to our Qatar leaders, Sister Joanne and Brother Marky, to our ICOC Qatar Singles Ministry leaders, Sister Jenny and Brother Bobby, and to all my brothers and sisters that I didn't mention, thank you so much for the love and encouragement. As we go further in our journey as a disciple, let's continue to be the light to others, to, co to commit to God the plans that we are planning for. Brothers and sisters, thank you so much for the love and encouragement. And to all my lovers and friends, guys, if you are facing those challenges that you have right now, always remember and always lift up your eyes and head that God is always there for us and whatever it takes and whatever happened, we just need to, uh, to talk to someone. We just need to open up to someone that someone are going to encourage us and inspire us. That someone that will bring us to the light that someone that inspire us to continue what life really is so to all my lovers and friends again thank you for the support and of course i just wanted to say that 
those sisters in ICOC Qatar and even in ICOC Philippines also. I am so happy and grateful to be part of this ICOC family and to our brothers and sisters also from different churches. Thank you so much and let's continue to uh, share the word of God to encourage other people who are facing challenges and continue the walk that we started. And once again, this is the end of the story of the farewell and encouragement party that we held in ICOC Qatar. Thank you so much and brothers and sisters, stay healthy and faithful. See you again soon. Thank you.